Most people inject the needle into the cord. They pull back because they get resistance. They inject the enzyme adjacent to the cord. The enzyme still works, but it dissolves the cord from outside in as opposed to inside out. The problem with that is much of the enzyme washes away and then our body has other enzymes that work against this enzyme, rendering it less efficacious, it doesn't work as well. With my technique, instead of injecting one to three locations, on average, I'm injecting the enzyme 12 different locations. I stick the needle right into the cord. When I stick the needle into the cord, there's resistance. That enzyme starts working instantaneously. As it's working, it's breaking the bonds that are holding the triple helix together. As the resistance goes away, I can easily inject. As I can easily inject, the enzyme runs along and inside the cord, dissolves the cord from inside out as opposed to outside in. That allows me to use less enzyme, inject more spots, get better results. So I call it the simple technique. This is a technique that I kind of came up with. Capital S-I-M. Capital S stands for slow, so I'm slowly injecting the enzyme. I for intracord, so I'm sticking it right into the cord, and M for the multi-cord, because most people only inject one cord, on average, I'm injecting 2.5 cords with one bottle of enzyme. So by using less enzyme, injecting more spots, getting better results, it overall decreases healthcare costs. And at two weeks, people's hands are looking like this, in contrast to surgery, where they typically will look like that at six to eight weeks, sometimes longer, depending on the severity of the surgery. Mm -hmm.